Okay, so today is day 24 without Facebook, and I'm still not caught up on my sleep from staying up all night last night, but um, I'm getting there. Uh, today is actually a little funny because um, I'm not really going to have that much time to do a challenge today because my sister has a big um, choir performance that we're all going to go to. We're probably leaving, we're leaving in about an hour. And um, so what, what I've been doing over these past few weeks is uh, doing a few prank phone calls to certain people and to certain um, institutions and just having some fun with them and just like being crazy and uh, today and right now I'm gonna I'm gonna do one uh, for my school but just so you guys know you know this video wasn't all shot today I know I'm sorry I'm breaking the whole uh, code of the 40 days without Facebook but um, I did take some time to do each prank call, so you know it still kind of counts. I think I'm not I'm not on Facebook today, so we're still going strong. It's still been an unbroken number of days, and um, hopefully it'll continue that way all the way up to 40 or 41, however long we decide to go. One that I called, I think I'll play it first, was one that I called um, last week before the Avengers premiere. I wanted to ask about costumes and stuff, so you'll see that 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 phone call that I called to the movie theaters that was placed a few days before we all showed up in full Avengers outfits, so look out for that. That'll be a funny one. But without further ado, here we go. Hey, John. Hey, man, not much. Uh, can I call you back real quick? With this, with my girlfriend's phone, because my phone is about to die. Okay, bye. John? Hey, John. What's up? Not much. What's up with you? Uh, not much either. Oh, okay. Hang cool. I was calling because I wanted to to tell you that, like, I want to get together and. And uh, hang out before before you leave, you know. But um, I can't really talk too much right now. I'll ha I'm gonna have to call you back later because I'm about to do something. But I was just hoping that we could get together sometime. Uh, it's fine. I'm here till June. So. Oh, okay. Well, that's cool. Well, I'll call you back in a bit. Okay. All right. All right. Talk to you later. All right. Bye. Later, John. So I'm gonna call the movie theaters right now. Uh, the one near my house. I'm going to ask about the Avengers movie because that's opening next week. And I might just make it a challenge next week. Something to do with the Avengers. I'm not sure yet what that will be. But we will cross that bridge when we come to it. Right now I'm just going to ask some questions and play around with the... Thank you for calling, Senator Mark. Hey, this is Robert. How may I help you? Yeah, hi. Um, I wanted to ask about the Avengers movie. Okay. Yeah, you know, the one with all the superheroes. Yeah, I know. Yeah, and and that that one when they're all like teaming up and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I wanted to ask, do you guys have any tickets left for the midnight showing? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, I, I'm sorry. I'm 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 stupid. Yes, for the midnight showing. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me just check for you. Okay, for the midnight showing for the non 3D. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely the non 3D. I have, I don't have any money to see the 3D one. I'm poor. Okay. For the non 3D, it's 225. What, what? What do you mean? It's. It is, I mean, sorry. There's 225 seats left. Oh. Oh, okay. I thought you meant it started at 225. I'm like, oh my god, I'm gonna be up for long, longer than midnight. Yeah. Wait. So there's 225 seats left. Out of 350. And when did you guys start selling? Uh, I believe we started selling them about. Uh, I want to say a week, maybe two ago. Okay, so that means about 100 nerds have already bought their tickets? Yeah, but those type of movies usually don't start selling out till the week of or the night of. Right, but next week is the week of, am I correct? But usually it'll probably start selling out sometime this week. And maybe, the, uh, usually that Thursday, that's when most of them are sold. Okay, so I want to go see it on opening night, non-3D, because, you know, I need, I need to save yeah. some money, but... So when do you suggest would be a good time for me to go before they start selling out? Uh, I'd say the early, probably, I don't know, around 12, 1. I mean, I mean, I mean, like, what days, like, what? Uh, you can come whenever. You, you, you honestly don't think they'll be sold out until the day of? Uh, I think the only 
showings that'll probably be selling out is more towards the evening. Uh huh. Around maybe like seven after seven p.m. and after. Oh, okay. Cause it just depends. Sometimes they sell out. Sometimes they don't. Well, yeah. I assume people have lives and they have to get up early for work the next day. Yeah. So okay. Um, I wanted to ask, what is Cinemark Victorville's policy on dressing up? So right. you can dress up the way you like, as long as it's not impeding the safety of the employees or other customers. Okay, so like no like uh, no work. no real bows yeah. and arrows. Like if I'm gonna dress up as Hawkeye, I can't bring a real bow and arrow into the. No. <laughs> okay, but if I was to dress up like say, oh I don't know, the Incredible Hulk, like that would be fine, right? Because it's just That'd a guy, fine. just a green guy painted all green. Yeah, that's fine. But no, but like I have to wear a shirt. Because no shoes, no shirt, no, 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 no service. service. Right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, see, that's what I was thinking. You know, I'm going to have to call my friends and tell them to put shirts on because otherwise that'd be just weird. Yeah. As long as they have, like, a green shirt on, you can say that's fine. Yeah, green shirt, I guess that would work. Yeah. Okay. And so, so it's fine then, right? Like, you're telling me it's cool if we dress up, like, yeah, just as long as we don't have... Okay, just as long as we don't dress up. So, I mean, if we don't dress up with, like, anything that's going to harm anyone, like, they can dress as provocatively as they want, right? Uh, yeah. Really? Yeah. As long as nothing's showing and they're still wearing shoes and still, yeah. Oh, okay, because that's, like, that's, like, for, like, the black, the, the, what what is her name? The Black Widow? Black Scarlet Widow, whatever? Yeah. Yeah. That, that girl. Yeah. Okay, I was just wondering. All right, you have yourself a good night, all right? All right, thank you. I'll see you with my band of Avengers pretty soon. <laughs> Sounds good. All right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm calling my friend again. Speaker. Why are you laughing? <laughs> Why are you laughing? Hello? Hey, John? Hey, John. Hey, Josh. Hey, dude, how's it going? Good. Hey, man, I can't really talk right now, so I'll call you in a bit, okay? Alright. Alright, bye. Alright. <laughs> I'm gonna call my college and ask about uh, a class that doesn't exist. I'm just gonna make one up. Here, how may I help you? Yes, hi. Um, I, I'm trying to find a, a, a specific class, and I was wondering if you could direct me to someone who can tell me where that class is. Like a classroom? No, no, a specific like science class. Like I, I, I'm, I'm taking a science class today, and I have no idea how to get there. You need to go and look that uh, class up on uh, the UCR class schedule, or, or or on your like student Growl account. Yeah. See, the the problem is that I'm I'm like driving there right now, and my class starts in like 20 minutes, and I have no I have no way of doing. There's nowhere I could send you to help you with that. You would have to quickly go on campus to a library and use it to look up that information because there's no department that would have that information for you. But, information's only online. But I, I, I called before and, and they, they helped me get to another class that I had to get to. All right, do you know who they connected you to? Ah, uh, no, I have no idea. Campus directory? Campus directory, uh, give me one minute. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, hi. Um, I'm trying to get to uh, a a class. Um, and I I don't know really. Did I just send you to? No one picked up. No. All right. Um, we don't have a campus directory. I don't know where the person the person that you spoke to before. I don't know where they sent you. Okay. Um, okay. Well, can can you help me out with this then? Can you tell me how to get to Watkins um one thousand and uh one thousand and shoot, what was the number? 1017, I think. All right. That sounds like, do you know where the Watkins building is? Uh... Have, 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 you, have, you, have you ever been on the campus? Well, well, yeah. Okay. Once or twice. All right. Um, when you're on the campus and you see the, you know where the bell tower is, right? Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, yeah. The big, the big thing with the, with the clock on the top that sounds yeah. every hour. Um, it is around there. If you're... How to describe it? Um, if you're by the bell tower uh, and facing, let me see. 
One minute. The bell tower has four faces on all sides, and it faces every single direction. <laughs> That's why she's having trouble figuring out how to how to tell me. All right. Do you know what parking lot you're parking in? Uh, the one with um. Like the lot number. Oh shoot! No, it's it's got a bunch of cars in it though. <laughs> okay. Um, the best way I could try to describe it is because. The bell tower is in the center, and so from all sides you can basically get to any class. Uh, however, if you stand in the bell tower uh -huh. and you see a big uh, commons area where with seats at the bottom, uh, and there there should be a sign around there that says Hub H U B. If that ends up on your right side, uh -huh. you will see. And, and you're facing a big patch of grass, there'll be two big patches of grass, either on your back or in front of you. If you're facing a big patch of grass and it's on your right side, that hub building, the Watkins building will be on your left side. It'll be a small two-story building and it'll have walls around the outside, like a, a wall or two that have huge holes in them, like Swiss cheese walls. Uh-huh. If you enter that building, that is Watkins. And I think that first floor is like Watkins, 1,100, and then, you know, you can find your classroom. From okay, okay, so, so, okay, so let me get this straight. If I, if I go onto the campus and I, and I, and I find the, the clock tower, if I turn, um, if I, if I'm looking straight at the clock tower and I turn right, then I'll see the, the hub? Yeah, you should see the hub, and it's like a, it has like a, a long, big winding ramp. That goes down to where there should be a bunch of seats uh, with uh, with like umbrellas outside. That's where the students go and eat. So that's the hub. So so I just have to I just have to face the the, the way that the clock tower is facing and the, the clock tower has a clock on every single side. It's it's a square. Wait. It has a clock on all four sides. Wait. Oh. Oh crap. Um. Yeah. So if so you have to face and and we both there's like two big long strips of grass. So, so do I face like wet, like do I, do I look for the direction that the sun is coming up and face opposite of that? Um, you would be facing, you should be Like west, right? Technically, yes, west. Southwest? No, just straight west, because uh, I'm, I'm looking at it at an actual map here. Uh, you should just be facing west, and you'll see the commons uh, or the hub will end up on your right side. Uh huh. And then the wall of Swiss cheese will be on the on the left side. Yeah, it, it'll be there'll be a big patch of grass, and then the wall with that. It's a very short two-story building. Yeah, that'll end up on your left side. Are the walls edible? <laughs> no. <laughs> they're not. No. Okay, uh, uh, Marty, they're not edible, so don't don't put your no don't put your tongue on them, please, dear God. Sorry about that. These students. They, they get fried by UCR sometimes. Okay, thank you so much for your help. Um, I will try to find uh, the Watkins 1017 uh, to the left of the hub. That I don't, yeah. To the, to the right of the clock tower facing west. Yes. Okay, thank you so much for your help. You've been most kind. Mm -hmm, no problem. You have a good day, and, and careful with that Swiss cheese. <laughs> Calling my friend John again. Hey, John? Hey, Josh? Hey, Johnny. How's it going? Uh, hey, I was just calling to say that I can't really talk right now, so I'll call you back in a few seconds, in a few minutes, okay? <laughs> I'll call you back in a little bit, alright? Alright. Alright, bye. <laughs> I'm about to call the Stater Brothers to uh, report that, that someone just stole their shopping cart. We'll see what happens. Yes, hello, Stater Brothers? Yes. Stater Brothers on Bear Valley? Yes. Bear Valley, yes. Uh, I, I, I see, I see man, he ran out with shopping cart. He ran out with the shopping cart? Yes, uh, yes, uh, he put shopping cart in, 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 uh, back, back trunk, trunk, trunk of car and, and took off, took off shop with shopping cart. Okay, and he didn't pay for it? Uh, no. Did you him run out the door? Yeah, oh, oh, shopping cart for sale? Out the door with the shopping cart full of groceries. Yes, yes, yes. He, he, no, he put it, he put the shopping cart in, in trunk, in trunk of, of a, of a purple truck. Uh -huh. He, he put it in and, and he drive, he drive away. Oh, with, with the groceries though in, in it, right? 
Jess, Jess, he he put he he had food. Yes, Jess. Okay, I'm gonna talk to the manager. Give me one. Okay, minute. okay, give me manager. Give me manager. Quick, quick. Okay. Hello, uh, manager, uh, Stater Brothers? Yes, it is. Yes, uh, uh, man, man, come out, Stater Brothers, with a shopping cart and put, put in his car and, and take off. Oh, yeah? Yes. No bags? Uh, what? No bags? Bags? I, 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 I don't know, I don't know, no bags. No, man, man, take off, uh, take off, uh, shopping cart, put in trunk of car and, 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 uh, and drive off. Oh, yeah? Yes, uh, purple truck. Yes, the the man he had the uh, glasses. He was the uh, Puerto Puerto Rican Puerto Rican. Right, right. Okay. Uh, 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 he he uh, very very fat fat man. But like he too much he he, he too oh, much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I see. Okay. He, he too much cake. <laughs> okay, um, I can go back on the cameras and look. Uh, yes. He's probably gone by now, but I'll go ahead and check it out and see what we can find on the, on the camera. Yes, it's 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 not it's not it's not legal, right? No, 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 not legal. No, no okay. Just, just, uh, catch, catch man, uh, he's bad man, he's very bad man. Yeah, oh yeah, definitely, definitely, yes, sir. Thank you for calling us. So just. We'll check into it, and then we'll see what we can get. Okay, okay, good luck. Thank you. God bless. Bye-bye. Okay, Hello? <laughs> <laughs> hey, John? Yeah? Hey, John, it's Josh. Josh? Josh, I mean John, I have something really important to tell you, but I can't really talk right now because I just called because I, I I gotta do something real quick. I'll call you back in a few minutes, okay? Okay, bye. Hello. Uh huh. Yes. Hi. I saw a sign on campus about room for rent. Yes. Yeah. Hi. Um, are you aware that the sign is uh, completely contradicting with the UCR policy for posting uh, home uh, renting agreement? What do you mean? Do you have any uh, you're, you're not allowed to post um, signs for rooms for rent at that specific area in UCR. Really? And it's in UCR? Are you sure it's over there? Uh, yes, I'm looking at it right now. I ripped off the paper and it says your number and it's in an illegal spot on UCR campus grounds and we cannot allow this to continue. Oh, really? Yes, really. This is a very serious matter. Oh, wow, because we had no idea that it was uh, on the campus. Uh, we, we did put, um, put it, but we put it like in the west side, the Craigslist. Yeah, no, the west side is part of campus. You can't do that. The west side, we, meaning the, because where we put it at was, the, uh, was Craigslist, the Craigslist. Yes, well, there's a, a sign on campus advertising your phone number saying that there is room for rent. And I am calling to tell you that this is not legal. You cannot do this unless you have given, get, gotten s explicit permission from the UCR campus. Oh, really? I have no idea how that sign got over there. Yes, well, uh, something has to be done about the sign because uh, we can't leave it up here uh, for people to see because it's the illegal. Paper? Yes, the paper. Well, I think you say, okay, well, could you take it off? Well, I, I could, ma'am, but I'm not I'm not the owner of the of this paper, so so someone has to come down here to take it off. Okay, that's, that's fine. I'll I'll see what I can do about that then. Thank you. Okay, wait, ma'am. Huh? Yes. Yeah. Well, how are you gonna get there if you don't know where the paper is? Because uh, someone must have put it there, so the person that put it there must know where exactly they put it at. Ma'am, do you realize the campus is is pretty huge, right? Yes. Oh, okay. I was just making sure because if the paper, I mean, if someone's going to come to get the paper, they have to know exactly where it is. Otherwise, they're not going to be able to find it because the campus is freaking huge. No, right. I mean, right. The person that posted there should know where they put it at. Right. And they should know that it's illegal and that further action can be taken by the UCR campus if, if this is allowed to continue. Okay. That, that's fine. Thank you very much. Okay. You have a nice day and God bless you. Thank you. Hi John, it's Josh. I was just calling to leave you a message just to say that I can't really leave you a message right now because I'm busy, so I'll call you back later. Alright, bye. <laughs> I just <laughs> I just sent my friend John a text saying, Hey, I was just texting you to let you know that I can't really text right now, I'll call you later. He said LOLs as long as you can still call when you can't text the vice versa. Oh my gosh. 
He's not even like mad or anything. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Hi. Hello. Um, who am I speaking with? Amanda. Hi, Amanda. Um, I, I buy your guys' um, cigars and stuff. Okay. And, um, one of your cigars gave me cancer. Okay. So, um, I was calling to see, uh, where, where, where's the, the people that I talked to for, like, the comments and the suggestions and stuff like that cuz i ha i have cancer now cuz of your cigars H hello amanda hello hello yes yeah hi who am i speaking to this is dave oh dave the guy in the in the picture yeah yeah, hi Dave. Uh one of your cigars gave me cancer. Okay, I mean you know that who's who am I talking to? My name is Jacob. My name is Jacob. Hello? Yes, I'm sorry. Oh <laughs> Yes, my name is Jacob. I buy your cigars and one of them gave me cancer. This one, huh? Obviously not. Do you think I'm I'm a simpleton, sir? Well, I don't know who you are in, in, in conversation. I mean, I, I don't make the cigars. Oh, oh, you don't make the cigars, so you think that that just frees you of the guilt then of giving people cancer? No, I didn't. You know, it, sir, it, sir, are you laughing at me? This is no laughing you. matter. I, 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 I could die of this disease, and you're laughing at me? Well, I, you're over 21 years old, are you not? Excuse me. I'm selling a legal product. Excuse me, is it legal to give people cancer agents? I did not I did not force the cigar in your mouth, sir. But you supplied them. You're fine with supplying them, right? I, 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 sell, I sell a product that is legal. So you sell a product that legally kills people, is what you're telling me. I didn't say that. There's no proof that, that cigars gives you cancer. I can give you proof. I got the x-rays right here. What, what do you want me to do about it? I want you... To eradicate your illegal practice. Well, I'm sorry, it's a legal practice, and after they ban tobacco, it's going to be illegal. Oh well, they're they're they'll ban tobacco, all right. As soon as I show them your picture and show them my picture of my lungs, I'll, they'll ban it, all right. Well, you do what you need to do, and we'll do what we have to do. That's what lawyers are. All right. Well, I will do that, and I'll, I'll hopefully be able to abolish your oppressive establishment that get that gets people yeah. death. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, you have a good day. God bless you, sir. Shoot, I don't think I can really hear him. John? Yeah? Hey, John, can you hear me? Can you hear you? Okay. Hey, John, I was just calling to let you know that I can't really talk right now, so I'll call you back in a little bit, okay? John? John, how can you treat how can you let how can you let me treat you like this? John, I, I've called you like five I've called you like six times and every single time I tell you that I can't talk right now. I even texted you saying I can't text you right now and you and you're completely like happy about it. Why 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 would you why why do you let why would you let me treat you like this? You just thought of it as an elaborate joke or prank? Yeah. Well, you know, I I think I don't think that many people would would be happy every single time that I would call them. I think I think you're very rare uh, a very rare gem because you you laugh every single time. <laughs> what? All right, but yeah. I was just calling. Um, yeah, it really, it really was a prank. You're actually on YouTube right now because I, I, I did this as a as a video thing for my YouTube channel. So you want you want to say something to YouTube? Okay. <laughs> That's what you want to say, okay? Uh, hello, world. <laughs>
Aren't you glad? Aren't you glad you're finally in one of my videos and you're not the first person to die? <laughs> alright. Alright, man. Well, it's been good talking to you. We'll, we'll meet up sometime, alright? Alright, bye. I love you. Alright. I love you. Um. <laughs> I, I love you as a friend as well. <laughs> okay, see you later, John. <laughs> he loves him too. <laughs>